Oh my gosh. Oh. Oh, don't tell me. Yep, he sealed it. He broke. And you were thinking that I have forgotten that Lisa Elrich just came out with new lipstick shades. No, no way that I will do that. Every year, twice a year, we should expect Lisa coming out with new lipstick shades. And the lipstick lover on me couldn't resist, although I was, at the time that she launched the lipsticks, I was moving. And then when I arrived here <laughs> to my new house, there's a lot of storage, but I'm still juggling stuff. You know how it is when you move. So I said, okay, I really need to focus on what are the shades that I really, really, really want to get, really want to try and kind of take it from there. So I did place my order. It finally arrived here. So I went ahead and picked it up five different shades three on her luxurious loosen lipsticks which are more of like a satin finish with a little bit of translucency they do have pigment and you can build them up and also i picked up two of the insanely saturated lipsticks which are more of like a demi matte finish so bare lips right now i'm gonna bring you closer and we're gonna do these lip swatches also arm swatches and we're gonna take a look at each of the shapes that i picked up starting first with je ne sais quoi a luxurious loosened lipstick it's a warm creamy coral and just by the name alone i wanted to have it <laughs> just because it's called je ne sais quoi Gorgeous shade. Another luxurious loose and lipstick, and this was actually launched last year, but it was out of a sock immediately after lunch and then i was never able to get my hands on it but this time around i secure myself with atomic cherry it's a fruit punch cocktail of a coral red definitely it has that cherry color reddish the first one as you can tell je ne sais quoi has a little bit more of like a pale pink undertone it looks kind of like neon The third and last shade that I got on her luxurious Lucent formulation, it is Wonder Wheel. A mouth-watering, vibrant reddish pink, a delicious, juicy, popsicle pink shade. When you swatch it, you can really see there's kind of like a hot pink tone to Wonder Wheel. And this feels so soft, creamy and hydrating. Going into the insanely saturated lipsticks strawberry chalk a sun filter red that hides a dash of shocking punk pink a bright shouty strawberry dietary hue definitely by the bullet you can even see that kind of like textured kind of look like if you are looking to a porous kind of stone these are supposed to be a demi matte formula. They carry a lot more pigment. 
Also, I want to mention that I'm filming in natural light and hopefully this will give you the best representation of how these lipsticks, they look in person. The last shade that I got on the insanely saturated formula is New Wave. It's an unshamably bold magenta, modern yet classic, subversive yet soft. This shade is a shade that I absolutely love. It's hard to find and done it right, it is very hard to find. I have a couple of these shades on my collection i think i have one from by rito another one from pat mcgrath i used to have one from um, what was it bite the, yeah bite and it was in the amuse bouche formulation gorgeous and by the way all the details of these products everything will be on the description box below along with the links and also the details of my makeup my foundation matches if you want to see like perhaps what will work you know in contrast with your skin tone everything will be on the description box below here you have it the new wave it broke oh this is so sad but nonetheless a beautiful shade look at this shade right here isn't it this gorgeous and it makes your teeth look even whiter so here we have it new wave oh what a shade it's gorgeous i just feel so bad that it broke <laughs> <laughs> so sad but this shade oh my goodness this shade is beautiful i mean all the shades all the shades from lisa elridge honestly stunning you have to tell me which one you like best on me and as far as as you can tell pigment is there on the insanely saturated lipsticks which are the demi matte they are comfortable demi matte they don't feel drying they don't feel um yeah, they feel really, really nice and comfortable. The Luxurious Lucen, like I was mentioning at the beginning, is one of those formulas that you can really build on the pigment go lightly and then build it up as you want more intensity. They are, I mean, you can tell it has a lot of moisturizing ingredients that really keep your lips very hydrated and supple. While the insanely saturated, they don't feel drying. So they do have also emollients, but the formula is just so perfect perfection 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 okay my friends and this makes it for this video short and sweet these are the shades that i got from lisa elridge summer lipstick lunch the next lunch of lipsticks usually they come late fall closer to the holiday season and usually are her velvet formulation which is oh another dream formula anyhow my friends i would love to hear from you if you have picked up any of the new lipstick shades from lisa elridge which shade you like on me which shade you're adding on your wish list let's just continue the conversation on the comment section down below where you add it and if you haven't done so yet i want to invite you to subscribe to my channel make sure you ring that post notification bell so you don't miss any of my uploads and come and follow me on my instagram if you like this video do not forget to give it a thumbs up also share with family and friends and until the next time i hope you have a beautiful, wonderful day. Bye-bye.